Hey guys, happy Monday. I thought I would do a day in the life working from home vlog today. It is Monday, May 4th. So happy Star Wars Day to all of you who celebrate May the 4th be with you. I have been a Star Wars fan my whole life. I may or may not watch some of the movies later today because it is Star Wars Day and Disney Plus or Disney released all of the movies digitally, which was awesome. I don't know how long or if it's a permanent thing or if it's just for Star Wars Day, but I know they released them all on Disney Plus, so that's pretty cool. I know they also released like a making of The Mandalorian. If you guys haven't watched that on Disney Plus, I would highly recommend it. If you're not a Star Wars fan, you probably won't like it, but if you are, it was fantastically done and directed and it really took an episode or two for me to get really into the show, but then once I did, I can't wait for season two. Well, let's just put it that way. So the plan for today is working, obviously. Still working from home. This is week eight of working from home. So we've been working home from home since May 16th. And I have work I need to do and get started with. For lunch, maybe I'll show you my lunch and my breakfast. I'll show you my, yeah, in a little bit when I make my breakfast. I don't eat first thing in the morning usually. Sometimes I do, but most of the time I'll wait till like 9, 30, 10 o'clock to eat breakfast. This week I got Greek yogurt and granola. I've been tired of my eating bagels every week, so I'm going to go back to my tried and true Greek yogurt and granola, so I'll show you that in a little bit. And then for lunch, I have, I'm going to make a big bowl of salad, I think. And for dinner, we're making this chicken um like stir fry it's chicken peppers and onions i'm just gonna fry it all up and we'll eat that for dinner probably with a side salad so i'm gonna get started on my work and i will check in with you guys in a little bit Okay, so it is 10 o'clock, so it's a little bit later now, and my face is definitely a little bit sunburned from being outside yesterday. I wasn't even outside for that long, but that just shows you I should have worn sunscreen. So I'm gonna grab some of my yogurt from the fridge. Today I'm just gonna have this light and fit Greek yogurt by Yoplait. And my cat is currently following me. I'm just gonna put this down on the counter here. Hopefully you guys can see what I'm doing try and get a little bit more light so yogurt the granola I'm gonna have is this nature valley granola protein oats and honey it's per two-thirds cup it's 270 calories per one ounce it's 120 calories so I'm just gonna mix some of this in oh that whole thing just came off of there <laughs> all right So I'm just gonna mix up the Greek yogurt a little bit here. And now I'm just gonna open this bad boy up and put some in there. And this will be my breakfast. Oh, there's some chomp. I'm gonna just chomp on these.
And there you have it, a simple, easy breakfast. I'm gonna eat this, head back upstairs to my office and get some work done, and I, <clears throat> I almost just choked on a piece of granola. I'm gonna go back upstairs, so that's it, that's how easy that breakfast is, yogurt, canola, boom, done. So I'm gonna head back upstairs, get some more work done, and I will check in with you around lunchtime and show you what I'm gonna cook up for lunch. Okay, so it is now lunchtime. I am away from my desk for my lunch break, and I decided instead of having a salad because it's chilly today, like it's only like in the 50s outside. Yesterday was so nice, it was like 80 degrees out. But anyways, today I'm gonna make this Annie's white cheddar mac and cheese for my lunch. It's super simple. I'm just getting ready to boil the water and it'll be ready in about 10, 15 minutes. So yeah, that's what I decided to have for lunch. Like I said, for dinner tonight, I'm making a chicken stir fry. The grocery store we go to had some like pre-made kits. So it had the chicken, the onions and the peppers already chopped up and ready to go. And I think with that, I'll make side salads again for dinner. We really enjoy having salads with our dinners every night, so I think that's what we'll have later. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna make my mac and cheese, probably watch a YouTube video or two on my lunch break, that's what I usually do. I was gonna go for a walk, but I don't know if it's gonna rain or what it's gonna do outside. It's kinda, it's super gloomy and gross out and I don't feel like changing my clothes. I'm, I'm in sweatpants and my sweater right now. I really don't feel like changing and getting into clothes to go outside so I think I'm gonna try and be productive and doing some dishes and some stuff around the house so that will be my noontime check-in and I don't know if I'm gonna film for the rest of today maybe I'll show you footage from me working except it's really boring because I'm just sitting at my desk working there's really nothing interesting going on I have a phone call at three o'clock but other than that, I don't have any meetings today, which is kind of crazy that I have no meetings. I don't know how that worked out, but I'm super lucky. So yeah, I'm gonna finish my lunch and we'll go from there. So it's the next day, it's Tuesday morning, and I just realized I didn't show you guys what we had for dinner last night. I think I mentioned that we were gonna be having chicken stir fry with peppers and onions. Instead of having that, it was kind of a spur of the moment decision last night. I made us uh, chicken quesadillas. I found um, like quesadilla shells at the grocery store. I haven't been able to find them in a couple of weeks and I wound up making those and they were really good. Uh, super easy recipe. Literally all you do is you fry up chicken and whatever veggies you want and then you take a tortilla shell, add cheese, your filling, fry it up, have it with salsa and that's it and it's, it's super easy and it's super cheap. I think total for that meal, it probably was like $10 for the two of us to be totally honest. So that was I had what I had, we had for dinner. And then for a snack last night, I had some fresh strawberries with a little bit of Coolip. Well, maybe a lot of Coolip. Um, it's not a lot of calories. And I had that for a snack last night. I found strawberries at my grocery store for like, I think they were like $2 for a container, which was ridiculously cheap, but I'm, kind of can see why they were so cheap because they weren't very sweet so I don't know if they were from a different source than I've gotten than they've used before but they weren't the they aren't the best strawberries ever but I was craving something sweet and I didn't want to have anything like chips or anything like that so I had some fresh strawberries with some cool up on top and that was really good so that kind of closed out our Tuesday, or that was Monday, sorry. Today is Tuesday, it's nice and sunny out today. They're saying we might get some snow this weekend, which is absolutely ridiculous. It's already May 5th and we haven't had a May snowfall in I wanna say at least 15 years. It's been a long time. So if we see snow this weekend, it's gonna be complete ridiculousness. But that's spring in the Northeast. We're stuck in a really crappy weather pattern. So I have finished my coffee already. I have to go get my breakfast in a little bit. It's gonna be the same yogurt and granola that you saw yesterday, so I'm not gonna show you that again. I'm not sure what I'm gonna have for lunch today. That Annie's mac and cheese was delicious yesterday. It was super chilly, so that was really nice. I don't know what I'm gonna make today. I haven't decided yet. Um, maybe I'll show you that in a little bit. But yeah, I'm gonna get to doing some work. I'm reviewing some documentation today for a project that I may or may not be helping out with. I don't know if things have changed. I also am getting 
pimple on my nose, which is really annoying. But yeah, that is my Tuesday morning update and I guess I will check in with you guys in a little bit. Okay, so now it is lunchtime and I wanted to update you on my lunch. So I'm just gonna heat up this Smart One frozen lunch, dinner, whatever you wanna call it. It's the ravioli Florentine. And then after I eat that, I'm gonna go outside for a little bit. I think I might go for a short walk because as you guys can probably see in the background, it is a super sunny day. It's supposed to be really chilly the rest of this week, so I'm gonna try and enjoy the sun while I can. I might just sit outside for a little bit. I have to bring the trash cans in anyways, and then I might go for a short walk around the block, maybe up and down my street just to move my legs a little bit. But yeah, that is pretty much it. And then for the rest of the afternoon, I have one meeting at three o'clock, but other than that, my calendar is free. Had a bunch of meetings and calls this morning to figure out work and projects and stuff for the rest of the year which is good, so I kind of know like where my work priorities are. That's always important. But yeah, I'm gonna heat my lunch up and I will talk to you guys in a little bit. Happy Wednesday, welcome back to the vlog. I realized that I'm really bad vlogging at night when my husband is home for whatever reason and I don't know why. So last night we made tacos, I think I mentioned that in the vlog um, yesterday afternoon and I went for two walks yesterday. I actually went for a walk on my lunch break like I mentioned and I went for a walk after we ate dinner. I just felt stir crazy yesterday and I knew I had to get out of the house and it was a pretty nice day outside. It was a little chilly but that didn't stop me from getting in some extra steps, so that was really good. And then to wind down last night, I watched a couple episodes of Better Call Saul on Netflix. I have two left, and then that's it. I know there's a fourth and a fifth season, I think, that exists, but Netflix only goes through season three, so I'll have to find something else to watch in the meantime. So leave your Netflix show recommendations in the comments, or let me know what you guys have been watching lately. On Netflix so that was last night today I am drinking my coffee in this mug my by the way my mom got me this mug when I started my first like real job out of college so I've had that mug for a long time and I'm eating my yogurt and granola today I have an Oikos triple zero Greek yogurt and that same Nature Valley protein granola the granola is actually really good I really like it I've never had it before so I'm definitely gonna repurchase it I am getting ready to start my work basically for the day. Tonight I have a Zoom call for grad school and then after my, my call with my professor's over I have a call with my project team. So that will pretty much take up my entire evening. And yeah, I don't know what I'm making for dinner yet. Maybe chicken. I don't know. I haven't decided yet. I'm getting really tired of cooking. We've been eating out like, I want to say like two days a week we've been ordering out but we've been supporting our favorite local businesses, so I don't really have too much of a problem with that. Um, yeah. So I guess I'm gonna get on to working. Maybe I'll try and show you guys what I make for lunch in a little bit. And I think that's gonna do it for now.
everybody. It is Thursday. It is lunchtime. Um, I am currently heating up some ramen noodles for lunch because I feel like it. Tonight we're making bacon and eggs for dinner because I found bacon at the grocery store, which was really exciting. So we're just gonna fry up the bacon, fry up some eggs, probably some toast, and have a breakfast for dinner. I like to do that every now and again. It's just something different. So right now I'm running a load of laundry, which you guys just saw. I thought it might be interesting if you were curious to see me loading the washer? I, I don't know. I, I have done vlogs in the past. I'm just trying to find interesting content for you. Hey guys, happy Friday, TGIF. It's about eight o'clock in the morning. I'm just starting my work day, but I wanted to come on and do a quick update. I look a hot mess this morning. I'm very tired because at about quarter to five this morning, both our phones started beeping out of nowhere and we didn't know what it was. Originally, we thought it was like our fridge or a kitchen appliance something was going wrong with? No. It turns out it was actually an Amber Alert that the New York State Police um, issued this morning for a child who could be in harm's way. So I really hope that everything works out. But yeah, that doesn't happen very often. So when it does, it you just kind of like jolt out of bed like, what the heck was that? So falling back asleep, only getting a couple more, an hour or two more sleep before we woke up. So I'm feeling pretty tired this morning, but you know, they gotta do what they do to get the word out there. So hopefully the police are able to find the child and everything works its way out. I'm of course working again today. Um, last night I attended an online webinar. I had all sorts of issues with my computer last night and with Zoom. I've used Zoom a couple of times this week. I had no problems with it. For whatever reason last night with the webinar that I was trying to call into or join on my computer, it wouldn't let me. I was getting all sorts of issues and errors. I tried it on my phone. My phone wasn't, it was okay, but it wasn't great. So I wound up using the, the version of Zoom that you can use in like Google Chrome. And that seemed to work, but it didn't have all the functionality I needed. So it was just frustrating. And I, I was just frustrated because it worked perfectly fine the night before. So I wound up uninstalling Zoom. I reinstalled it. Hopefully that fixes it. I realized that my MacBook is like a couple versions behind. Like Zoom was saying that your Mac operating system should be version like 1014 or something and mine's only on 1012. My laptop's older so I don't even know if it's going to get the, the updates for the newer OS's. So I'm kind of just waiting this out until stores start opening because the first thing I'm doing is I'm getting a new iPhone and a new laptop. They're both at the end of their lives, clearly. So I just need to make the investment. I was going to do that back in March when I got my bonus, but as we all know, that's when New York State put the pause in effect and they closed everything. So I've, my laptop is hanging on for dear life, I think, right now. So that is definitely going to be like one of the first things I do once this whole thing starts to calm down. But yeah, I like I said, I have to work today. Not a ton of weekend plans. I think Sunday I'm going to go down to my mom's for Mother's Day. We're going to be cooking our dinner, so that will be good. But yeah, I hope you guys have enjoyed the clips I've taken all week in this vlog. If you want to see something else like this, um, let me know and I can film a day in the life and maybe actually show you guys my dinners because I'm so terrible at doing it in the evenings. But yeah, I hope you guys have a great rest of your day and I'll try and get this vlog up as soon as I can. And don't forget to subscribe if you're new to my channel. Give this video a big thumbs up. It really helps me out on YouTube and I will see you in my next video. I hope you guys are doing well. Stay safe. Bye.